I think when you just look at the dynamic of the class uh, and the 4 half as an individual, boy, get off the side of her. She's beautiful headed. I love the way her shoulder assembly is uh, designed, the slope of her knee, the squareness of her front feet. Uh, and then when that heifer gets out and goes, I talked about it a few times in reasons. You guys won the falter that she's just a little bit off in her sh behind her shoulder uh, in terms of her top line, but when she gets out and strolls, uh, that comes back up in her. Uh, she stays really, really collected from that regard. I love the flexibility she's got in terms of her hock and her pastern. No doubt about it, we could probably just square that heifer up just a little bit. She wants to pull her hock in just ever so slightly from behind, and no doubt, if we could just pick her pin set up just a freckle, uh, I think that heifer's got a world of good to her. A lot of you guys let off with a power discussion on her, uh, and I'm not saying that heifer is not powerful. I definitely think she's adequate from that regard, but I think the thing that gets that heifer going uh, is just her balance and her flexibility, her female qualities, second to none in this class.